The greatest manhunt I can recollect in the whole history of the Southwest was for a youngster just barely out of his teens. Horses rode the trails day and night, ready to shoot to kill. Their quarry was the most vicious desperado that ever lived. It was Billy the Kid. He didn't look like much. He had a disarming, friendly smile and a happy disposition that made people like him and trust him to their sorrow, as my adopted son, Buffalo Bill Jr., found out. Billy the Kid sent one of his gang, a renegade named Charlie Baudray, to meet the posse. Nobody knows exactly what happened that day, but as near as we can piece it together, the outlaws lured the posse members into an ambush under a flag of truce. Charlie Baudray likely made the sheriff and posse believed he was turning Billy the Kid in for the reward money. And he must have convinced them that Billy was wounded or asleep, or they never would have walked into that trap the way they must have. Billy, you sure ain't lost your shooting, eh? I'm running low on ammunition. See if any of them got any 38. Oh, well, they got 45s, Billy. You better take one of their guns and load up on cartridges. Not me. I'll stick by my 38. They never failed me yet. I hereby appoint you the new sheriff of Socorro County. Me? A sheriff? That's good. Charlie Baudry, sheriff. <laughs> Billy, you're a card. <laughs> all this happened just a few miles from Wileyville. But all we knew was that Billy the Kid was dodging lawmen from New Mexico, Arizona, and Oklahoma. And even the Texas Panhandle men had ridden up to join the hunt. Some of them had a score to settle. Others just wanted to try to reward money. Like my son Bill, Buffalo Bill Jr., we call him, though that's not his real name. And he's not really my son either, though I've treated him like one ever since I adopted him and his orphan sister, Calamity. Look at this, Judge. $5,000 reward for the capture of Billy the Kid, dead or alive. 5000 That's a heap of money. Hey, what are you doing? Getting ready to collect that reward. Ah. You got to split with me, Bill. After all, I was the one that found that reward notice, wasn't I? Yeah, but I'm going to be the one that captures him. Me too. I'm going with you. You are not. You're staying put right here. Why not? Two reasons. First, you're a little girl. Second, you're... Oh, Bill. Too young for dangerous work like this. You're staying put right here. And so are you, young man. Any outlaw capturing to be done around here, I'll be handling it. The duly authorized constable of Wiley, Bill. But, Judge, Billy, the kid's got a reputation of being real fast with a six-gun. <laughs> Don't you worry, none. This old Sharps rifle has pulled me through more scrapes than you could shake a stick at. And I'm leaving you in charge of things until I get back. I'll watch the store. You get busy in the kitchen with those breakfast dishes. All right. I'll wash with you dry. Well, now, you heard what the judge said. He says, I'm in charge here till he gets back. And that includes you. We're going after Billy the Kid. You want to come along, Judge? I ain't going duck hunting with this thing. Come on, men, follow me. Oh, come on, Nelly, let's go. Go that way. Come on. That fuzzy really means business. <laughs> You better watch out for them, Billy. Yeah, especially that old geezer on the mule. <laughs> ah, come on, Nelly, let's go. Why are they two miles? I wonder if I could get me some 38 cartridges there. Sure, right in your belly if anybody recognizes you. Well, we could use some food, too. I'm hungry enough to chew on my stuff. Charlie, I'll ride on ahead. You can drift in later.
to butt it in and try to tag along with me, the judge... Shh. He's outside now. Who? Billy the Kid. Why don't you go out there and surround me? I am. I'm in the, the end. Look. Now, what makes you so sure it's him? Well, he's little and he is... Oh, I don't know, but I just know it's him. You know, he probably heard that you were on his trail and he came up here to give himself up. Don't be funny. Now, you're the one that's being funny. Why, Billy the Kid's never even had a photograph taken of himself. So no one knows what he looks like except the men in his gang and you. Shh! He's coming inside now. Howdy. What can I do for you? Well, let's see now. I'd like to get me some sugar. About a pound. Sugar. One pound of sugar. Anything else? Yeah, some flour, coffee, and... Uh, oh, yeah, and some beans. Coffee, flour, and the beans. Not many people around town, are there? They're after Billy the Kid. Haven't you heard about it? Oh, sure. In fact, that's why I'm here. It'll be 70 cents. The food's getting higher all the time. Just right. Have a couple cookies. Our compliments. Well, thanks. Oh, I clean forgot. I need some cartridges. 38. I think they're out here at back. Find them yet, Calamity? Not yet. Better help me look. He asked for 38s, didn't he? That's the caliber gun Billy the Kid uses. And so do hundreds of other people. If that was Billy the Kid, would he have paid for the stuff he bought? No, he'd have stolen it. Gosh, I hadn't thought of that. Here you are. One dollar. What did you use all your bullets on, mister? Target practice. Are you a pretty good shot? Some people seem to think so. My brother is, too. I bet you he could shoot rigs around you. Uh, Calamity, are you sure you've washed all those dishes back there? How much are you willing to bet? Well, if you beat him, you can have that box of bullets free. But if he beats you, you pay double. Now, you know what the judge says about gambling. Well, if that's so, well, then how come he gambles himself? The judge gambles? Oh, sure. All the time he does it. Oh, yeah, that's right, now that you mention it. Go on, show him. Where will we shoot? Ooh, out behind the livery stable? Judge runs that, too. Fine, I'll water my horse while we're there. There we are. Let's go back over here. cans of peas. Now, who goes first? Me. I always like to shoot first. Fine. Four out of five. How's that? Well, that's real good. Say, uh, you can really handle that shooting iron of yours. What about that can you missed? You got a shot left. All right. I'll set up some more cans. Don't bother. I don't want to lick. Well, so long.
Frank. Whoa, now. She didn't realize what she's doing. She just... Sheriff of Sequoia County, why? Well, we captured Billy the Kid. Come inside quick. Billy the Kid, you don't say. <laughs> What's so funny? Huh? Oh, uh, well, uh, that ain't Billy the Kid. That's Walter Bradford, one of my deputies. Oh, I I'm sure sorry. But oh, I lost my clipper when I saw you go after Calamity with that knife. Calamity is right. She blamed near hanged me. You lost your gun up there. We'll go find it for you. Come on, Calamity. Billy. The hell's a swamp with posses all around here. Not even your gun could blast a way through. Then I'll hold up here for a spell. Slip out and spread the word that I've hightailed it for the border. Oh, then I come back here and we head north, huh? <laughs> Charlie, you're getting smarter every day. <laughs> Where are you gonna stay? Right here. Right here. Listen, kid, aren't you pregnant? Go on, Calamity. Do as I told you now. Here's your gun back, mister. And I... I apologize. Me too, and I sure wish there was some way we could make it up to you. Well, there is. You could put me up here for a while. The sheriff here wants me to keep an eye on this stable. In case Billy the kid comes by there, it was horse shot or something. Blacksmith stable's a likely place to watch. If you see or hear anything suspicious like, why, well, let me know. I'll be on the trail south. I heard a rumor that the kid was making tracks for the border. I'll keep my eyes peeled, Sheriff. Except the sheriff of Socorro rode through and he left one of his deputies at a stakeout. There he is. So well, you're from Socorro County, eh? I'm Judge Ben Wiley. Fair and square, Wiley, they call me. Yes, it's an honor and a privilege to have you with us. Thanks. Uh, come on inside. We'll fix up a place for you back at the store. Well, if it's all the same to you, Judge, I'd just as soon stay here in the barn. That way I can, well, keep a better watch on things. Well, suit yourself. And as Constable of Wileyville, if there's anything I can do to help you, just let me know. Thanks, Judge. It's nice to know I'm counting. Bill, come here. Did you sell anybody a plug of tobacco while I was gone? No, sir, I sure didn't. Well, that's strange. I just filled that shelf only this morning. Come and get it! Come on, deputy. Hey, wait a minute. What's this? Stealing tobacco, and you a representative of the law. Well, I hadn't mind to pay for it, Judge, but, well, I figured you might not like the idea of me using tobacco. I certainly don't. I don't know which is the worst, stealing or using chawing tobacco. Well, you won't catch me doing it again. I can promise you that. Well, you better not, son. Of course, deputy or not, if you do, I'll put you in jail and teach you a lesson you won't soon forget. Now, don't you ever do that again. Come on, let's go eat. Sit down over there. 
Take your hat off. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, for what we're about to receive, we thank thee. Well, now, Calamity, we'll see what kind of a dinner you cook for us tonight. You watch this end of town. Everybody it comes in or out. You two check those houses. You boys, come with me. Hey, what's going on? It's Sheriff Pat Garrett. He's trying to smoke out Billy the Kid. Hey, what's up? Sheriff Pat Garrett's making a house to house search. you think Sheriff Garrett can catch him? Well, it just so happens he's the only man alive that knows what the kid looks like. Then I guess he can smoke him out if anybody can. Hey, what are you doing back there? Come on out here. Just as I thought, stealing tobacco again. I warned you about this. Court is now in session. Are you pleading guilty or not guilty? I reckon I'm guilty, all right, Judge. Then I sentence you to two days in jail. Lock him up, Bill. Not back. Well, howdy. I'm Sheriff Garrett of Lincoln County, New Mexico. Yes, Sheriff. I know all about you. My name's Wiley. Judge Ben Farron Square Wiley. Glad to know you. Well, the Sheriff of Socorro rode through here a few days ago, and he said that Billy the Kid had been seen heading for the border. That sounds like one of his tricks. Well, thanks for the tip anyway. Oh, you're welcome anytime. Bye. Bye now. And the bodies later identified as the sheriff of Socorro County and three of his deputies were found riddled with bullets in the adobe ruins. Murdered by persons unknown, circum strongly point to Billy the Kid and his gang of desperate the de Desperado. Too bad. That sheriff seemed like such a nice man. Yeah, so does Billy the Kid. What do you mean? That's him, all right. That's who we've got locked up in jail. What makes you think so? Well, that wasn't a sheriff that showed up here the other day. He was just wearing a badge of the man they murdered. But maybe the sheriff was murdered by Billy the Kid after we saw him. No, the kid's been right here all the time that posse was scarring the hills. He was smart enough to get himself thrown in jail when Sheriff Pat Garrett came by because that's the last place he'd look for him. We'd better tell the judge. Right. Billy the Kid? That innocent-looking youth? I can't believe it. Well, nobody can. That's how he come he got by all these years. And to think I lectured him for stealing a plug of tobacco. Let's go out and ask him some questions. It's a good idea. He's gone. Escape. Look, the lock has been smashed. You must have had help from outside. Better get word to Sheriff Garrett. You ought to be able to catch up with Sheriff Garrett somewhere on the trail south. It's Billy the Kid's horse. He must still be here. Yeah, I'm still here. Dolly, get your hands up. Tie him up. Tiny capers, and I'll blow your head off. Hey, the kid's getting away. No, Bill, you can't stand up against those killers. I can try. Oh, you would be just one more victim on Billy the Kid's list. Get on your horse and go after Pat Garrett. The judge is right. Do what he says for me. Right. <laughs>
where he fell off. Sneak a little muckworm. Hey! Hey there! We've got the kid's horse. Where is he? He's back down that gully there. But he's got another outlaw with him. That must be Charles Baudry. Watch the horses. Garrett. Under arrest. I make no deals with outlaws. That suits me. I'm sick and tired of running. A billion a kid do his own fight. Where is he? Back in there. He's wounded. Watch him. Hold it, kid. Reach for a cloud. I'll take those guns. All right, now let's go down and see the sheriff. Come on, move. Here he is, Mr. Garrett. And Billy the Kid was brought to trial, sentenced and taken to Lincoln to be executed. But he murdered his guards and escaped. Sheriff Pat Garrett again took up the trail and cornered and killed the notorious outlaw at Fort Sumner, New Mexico. Well, I knew it was Billy the Kid all the time. Then why didn't you tell me, young lady? And you too, young man. I hereby sentence you to 30 days for concealing information. The both of you. 30 days? In jail? No. Washing dishes all by yourselves. But, Judge. Just one month off for good behavior. <laughs> 